Hey guys, Dr. Katie, right here on Hey Doc with Health Snippets. Ladies, do you get constant lower abdominal pain? Well, have you heard of PID? Otherwise known as pelvic inflammatory disease, it is a serious infection that can affect one or multiple parts of the female reproductive organs. It's caused by sexually transmitted infections, also known as STIs. The most common sexually transmitted infections that cause PID are chlamydia and gonorrhea. Those of us who started having sex at a young age, those who have multiple sexual partners, those who engage in sex without any contraception, or even those who have had a previous history of STIs of PID are at an increased risk of developing PID. Hey, I've got something to tell you. Did you know that I was a Christian? Yes, I believe in Jesus Christ being the only begotten Son of God who came to die on the cross so that you and I could have a relationship with a perfect Heavenly Father. I'd like to share a scripture with you. John 3.16, it says, For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son so that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. On that note, I'd like to invite you to come to Jesus. Not only can he sustain your health, but he can also heal you of all of your diseases. Beyond that, he also promises that you might have life in abundance here on earth and also in eternity. Now, back to PID. Why is this important? Because many women who actually have PID are not aware that they have this infection. So, with time, the infection gets worse and more serious, affecting multiple parts of their reproductive organ. The most serious complication that PID causes is infertility. And this happens because it blocks the tubes, thereby preventing any egg release from the ovary to reach the area where it can be fertilized. So by the time the infection is diagnosed, it is already too late because it would have caused irreversible damage to the parts of the reproductive system it has affected. So if you are someone who is sexually active and you have never had an STD screen or check, it is important that you do one as soon as possible or if you are involved and sexually intimate with anyone who you think might be unfaithful having had another part another partner or multiple other partners you must carry out an STI screen regularly because the aim of doing so helps you to catch the infection early thereby preventing complications later on so that's it guys we'll see you later right here on Haydock